The Dalai Lama hosted a well-received speech in Los Angeles this past Wednesday. In attendance was the high-profile American actress Sharon Stone. Almost at the same time, the U.S. Congress awarded the Dalai Lama the nation's highest civilian honor, the Congressional Gold Medal. The Dalai Lama was awarded the Congressional Gold Medal, the nation's highest civilian honor, in recognition of his advocacy of religious harmony, nonviolence, and human rights throughout the world, and for his efforts to find a peaceful solution to the Tibet issue through dialogue with the Chinese regime. The House of Representatives passed the bill with overwhelming, broad bipartisan support. The spiritual leader told his audience that he learns as much from others as they do from him. Like this, kind of this kind of meeting, public meeting, is very useful to myself to questions and answers. I also gain some new ideas or certain new points come from questions, so that gives me the opportunity to think more deeply. So useful. And to the audience, sometimes you may get some new ideas or new concepts. The Dalai Lama also won the Nobel Prize in 1989, almost 40 years after Chinese Communist troops marched into his homeland. He fled to India in 1959. Repression of Tibetan Buddhism continues in Tibet. Academy-nominated actress Sharon Stone was in the audience. She chose not to attend the Venice Film Festival to promote her latest film, Bobby, but to instead meet with the Buddhist spiritual leader. After the Dalai Lama's speech, Stone hosted a screening for the film Milarepa, directed by a Tibetan Lama.